no matter what, you have to post daily. You have to show up daily, period. What's poppin' bells? It's your girl, Mella Bell, back. We got another business video. If you're new here, go ahead and subscribe. Like, comment, follow me on social media so I can follow you on social media so we can get all this wealth and health and just success flowing between the both of us, okay? Like, make sure you follow me, follow you guys back, make sure you share your videos with me so I can watch them, I can like them, and I can share them as well. And without further ado, a little introduction, a little plug, let's get into today's gym, okay? Today's gym. So, on my social media, I asked you guys, I did a kind of like a poll to see what you guys wanted to see this week. I asked a few different options and you guys said that you wanted to know how to make sales every day. And I got you covered, okay? So let's just get right into it. No more rambling, no more babbling. Let's get this, let's get this lesson, okay? So first things first. First things first, I'm the realist. I feel like, I don't wanna say this is more important than anything, but the first thing is definitely to make daily posts, okay? If you're running a business and you're selling products, you have to make daily posts, daily, you know, videos, daily. You have to run traffic through your social media every single day. And it sounds like, man, I gotta post every day. I have to find something to post every day. I have to have something to post every day. Yes, you do. And especially if you're new because your post that is how people know what kind of products you have. That's how they know how, what the quality of your product is, what kind of seller you are, what kind of uh, merchant you are. They, they can see all that through the thing that you post, the type of content that you post, the quality of that content that you post. Don't go and put your t-shirt on your bed and just snap a picture that's blurry. You got stuff in the background. Like It, it matters. What you post matters. And couple tips to help you with thinking about posting every day try to plan out your content okay like for me on Sundays I try to plan out my content at least for Monday and Tuesday okay what am I gonna post do I want to post product do I want to post something motivational do I want to post a flat pick to run to get that extra audience coming in what is it that I want to post I go ahead and write my caption I format my caption I say you know whatever I'm gonna say something motivational tie back into link in my bio and I add the right hashtags and hashtag that's a whole nother whole nother video to be honest with you and I add the right hashtag so you know you want to post every single day and and to say that to go with that you're not going to get the likes and the engagement every single day that you might be looking for or you might be posting for so you have to understand that even on those days when your engagement isn't the greatest keep posting especially if you're on instagram keep posting because it's still helping you it's helping your algorithm by being on there every day posting every day engaging every single day okay your business is you you want people to be able to click on your page and say okay i know exactly what she sells i know exactly how to get to her products and it's no question i know how to contact her if i need to and her it's eye-catching wow i love looking at her page she's this or you know he's this and look at their products look at the pictures they're appealing they they draw me in oh the caption that's that's tough that's dope i don't even think i'm about it but i'm gonna share this just because it's that dope and that's your goal of posting every single day okay so we want to post every day we want to bring people in every single day another tip that i have for making sales every single day is to set up a newsletter now, you know when you sign up for Fashion Nova and Shein and all stuff like that and they send you emails and sometimes they catch your eye, sometimes they don't. 
But baby, when you see 50% off in that sub subject box, you be you click with the quickness. Like, wait a minute, what percent off? 50% off? It's a coupon for what? So when you give people, when you have uh, give people the option to sign up for a newsletter or something of the sort, maybe like um, a texting um, communicated way to text uh, out coupons, things like that. It gives, it's an incentive. It gives people something to look forward to. Hey, keep in touch with me and my business, sign up for my newsletter and you get exclusives. You get uh, to see what products are gonna drop before they drop. You're going to get discounts, exclusive offers. You might get free samples of things. Like depending on what you sell, that'll be for you to determine. But those are things that you want to think about and that you want to keep in mind. Because signing up, allowing people to sign up for a newsletter or some type of text chain or something like that gives people daily access to you and what you're doing. So their email, they're seeing coupons, they're seeing dope pictures, they're seeing, oh man, this is a cool product, she didn't even drop it yet, that's cool. They're seeing things that the daily posts and the things on your page won't necessarily show them. So you want to give people that option to have that behind the scenes or that back door to your business so they can feel more connected to you and they can feel important and feel exclusive. And when people feel important, they feel exclusive Exclusive when it comes to a certain business, they want to buy product, they want to support, they want to spend their money and they want to tell other people, girl, I signed up for her email thing and she gave me a 50% off coupon good for 48 hours you know and they t people talk about that kind of stuff when fashion nova has a sale girl did you see fashion nova sale again they got 80 percent off the whole website girl i know screenshot oh sis did you see that they got 80 percent off you better go get your set people talk people will talk when good things are put in place for a business okay and that's just facts okay daily posts Offer a newsletter or a text chain option and show your products. That's gonna be number three today. Show your products. Let me tell you something. You do not need to have a hair page, a nail page, a clothing page, a I do taxes page, I fix windows page. You don't need a page for every single thing, service, or product that you offer, okay? That is a really big misconception when it comes to business. You do not need to have six different pages. You want all your followers to follow all six pages. You gotta post daily on all six pages. You gotta keep traffic on all six pages, respond on all six pages. It becomes too much, okay? And that's another thing that customers do not enjoy when there's too much going on and they can't clearly see, okay, what does this girl do? What's her main thing? How do I even, what does she sell? You don't want people to have to ask themselves that question when they want to buy something from you. So what you wanna do is you wanna show your products. When it comes to those daily posts, make sure that you're showing your products. It's cool to post something motivational, it's cool to post a flat pic, but you want to show your products, okay? People go to your page and that's what they're looking for. What does she sell? Where's her website link? Where can I find this dope? Ooh, wait, that's a cool jacket. That's a cute jacket. Where can I find this jacket? But they won't know how cute the jacket is if you don't post it. Or the shoes, or the headbands, or the bonnets, or whatever you're selling. They won't know how cool and how cute it is if you do not show it, okay? So that's kind of, it's kind of straightforward. It's kind of black and white. You want to show your product. You want to show people what you have. Again, it ties into the daily post and it also ties into the quality of your content because you want to post good, crisp pictures, nice lighting. You know, you want your background to be nice. Even if it's just plain, you want it to be nice and you want your products to be you want to show the true quality of your products, okay? So show your products, okay? Don't be scared to show your products. Even if you post your product and it gets two likes or it gets no likes or whatever, keep posting your products because eventually, when you grow your audience, you grow your clientele, you grow your business, people are gonna go to your page and that's what they wanna see. They wanna see what you have. You sell hair, sis? I'm not buying hair from you if I can't even go on your page and see the hair. I have to DM you and say, what does your hair look like? Can you send me a picture? What is the bundle? I should not have to go the extra mile as a customer to ask that. So you have to keep that in mind when you are getting ready to post and show your products. Show people so they don't have to ask. Oh, you 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 know you put a plain background and you type. Oh, I have I have bonnets on hand. 
Okay, you post that on your page or your story. I go to your page, I don't see any bonnets. Guess what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna click off. Or I'm gonna DM you and say, oh, I saw that you have bonnets on here. What colors do you have? What patterns do you have? Are they ones? Now I have to ask you all these questions that you have to, you know, respond to. So show your products. Don't be afraid to show your product. Show your products every day. Make sure you're the, the pictures, the videos, everything that you're posting is quality. All right, that's that. That was number three. Number four, you want to be sure that you are responding. You cannot make money every single day if you're not responding to people who have questions, inquiries, same thing, or they just want to know a little bit more, or maybe they want to personally make the transaction with you. Yeah, you have a website, but maybe they want to just do it through DM, or through your text number, or through email. You have to respond every day. If you're busy, or you're not good at responding, or you can't, you don't have a good response time, pay somebody to do that type of stuff for you, or you got a homegirl or homeboy, get somebody to manage those responses for you. Do not leave people unopened or on open for 24 hours because if i ask you hey i want to give you my money i ask you hey do you have this in blue i really like the pink but i want to get one for my daughter she likes blue you know I'm, I'm i have it in my car but i was just waiting waiting to see what you have they just said they were spending money. They waiting on you, but because you're so busy and you can't respond in time and da da da, you just might have lost a potential sale, and that's not good. Because when people, when people, when you leave a sour taste in people's mouth, they also spread that as well. Well, oh girl, yeah, I just uh, I like your bonnet. That looks like a metal bell bonnet. Yeah, I tried to get a bonnet from her, but she didn't respond, and you know, she left me on open, and she responded to me like two days later, and I forgot all about it was in my car, and I didn't even want it at that point. You don't want people to, to, to say that about your business. So you wanna make sure that you're responding every single day. You're responding every single day, you're going through your emails every day, you're going through your DMs every day. If you have a text number or your regular number, you're taking time out of your day slash night to sift through those things and see what needs to be responded to, what needs to be fulfilled, and who needs questions answered. Because you don't want to say, you don't want to leave people hanging. That's the worst thing you can do. All right, so let's do a quick recap. You want to make daily posts, posts every single day, okay? No matter, you know, even if it's a short post, a short caption, you want to post every single day. Offer a newsletter or a text chain, something that makes people feel exclusive, something that makes people feel included like oh man like i get to see stuff that nobody gets to see show your products you want to show your products you want people to see what you have you want people to see the quality of what you have and you want people to see that look i don't have to ask no questions i know exactly what this girl has because i can look on her page and i can see exactly what she has don't leave people questioning okay number four you want to respond response time response frequency and how you respond is very important so don't leave people on open don't leave people on deliver don't leave people waiting and getting frustrated because they can't even get in touch with you as a ceo or if you have people working for you be sure that they are responding to people because that is important do not lose out on sales and do not lose out on money all because you do not take the time to respond to somebody. Right, basically those are for those are for a quick and easy i feel like main things that will help you make sales every single day make money every single day sell products every single day it's not hard you just have to keep in mind especially if you're a newer business it's something that you want to start out doing you don't want to wait until your business is two three months in and then start doing these things now you want to start off strong so that is my tips for you guys today next week we'll be back with something bigger something better something more until then make sure you subscribe make sure you follow me on social media if you have any one-on-one -on -one questions or personal questions because like i said i will respond i will help you out i will do what i can everything will be in the description box below and i'll see you guys next week